there everyone i have quite a lot of these 5d diamonds paintings uh pearls because i made quite a lot of these pictures i really love this so um i want to do something with these i'm going to use these pink one for this project using my glass to draw on the circle on the board that i'm going to cut it out of and I'm using my scroll saw to cut out the tabletop. After I cut it out, I sanded it a bit and now I'm just going to paint it black. I'm using my Citadel paint for that. I like this paint for miniatures, but you can use an acrylic paint instead if you have that. I painted on both sides of this tabletop and then when it was dry, I gave it a bit of glaze again on both sides. I used some white school glue and spread that all over the tabletop. And then I started placing all these nice 5D beads on there, one by one, starting from the outside, working slowly to the inside. Take your time with this so the beads don't pop up when you're pushing them down into these uh, circles. If you want to, you can make some patterns and stuff like that. I just wanted to keep this simple to see how it would look. I really want to use some of these 5D beads to something. I think it's sad to just throw them all out. So if you do sit with an idea for something I can make with these in 1 to 12, then please tell me in the info box below, I would really like to know. I'm working a bit more careful here in the middle of the table. When it's uh, all done, I am going to leave it to dry for a long period of time. So I'm really, really sure that they're good and stuck on there. I have this special tape that is meant for using with UV resin. So I am taking a strip of that and putting around the edge of the table. And I am cutting uh, some small slips in there so that I can bend the extra tape under the table to avoid spillage of the UV resin. Then I am taking some of my UV resin and pour it in there and making sure that there is a nice thin layer all over the tabletop. When I have a nice even layer of resin, I am carefully bringing it to my window and leaving the sun to do the first work on it and after it is a little more hardened I am using my UV light to harden it all the way through. This way it will not bend at all. After the UV resin has cured I am going to take off the um, tape around the edge and I'm going to sand it a bit to make it look a little more nice. Then I am going to do the uh, stand for the table. For that I took this skewer and I measured 5.5 centimeters up and I found a few beads that I liked in my collection of wood beads. I'm starting with this flat bead and I'm gluing the skewer into that and then I'm just uh, putting the rest of the beads onto the skewer with a little glue in between. And when I have placed them like I want them, then I just let the glue dry. When all the glue is dry, I am going to paint this all black so that it match the tabletop.
I wanted the foot and the tabletop to match together so I took some of these 5D plastic beads from the diamond paintings and I also glued a few of that around the foot. I gave it two different colors in uh, the circumference of the foot here. Then I glued the two parts together. And as I sanded the table, I am again painting the backside of the table and the edge of the table with the black paint. When it's all dry, I am using this really thin UV resin to put on the table to make it really shiny again after I sanded it. I'm doing it on the top surface and on the sides and then I'm just placing it under my lamp until it's really hard. After that, I am giving the leg of the table the same treatment this thin UV resin all over the bottom part and then into my UV light to make it harden again. This was a fun little craft, I hope you like it. If you have some ideas for what I can use these 5D beads for, then please tell me below. Thank you for watching, happy crafting!